Hey everyone, my name is Winnie. I hope that you all were able to catch the first episode of Her Wellness Journey TV. I thought about it and I was like, man, I was really pushing myself to not hold back and put out content and start creating because I didn't want to allow procrastination to stop me from doing what I was so passionate about and learning from my previous experiences that I was like, people are probably thinking, what is her wellness journey and or HWJ TV even, and what is she talking about? So really quickly, her wellness journey uh, started about a year or so ago, and it started off rather small actually. It started off, I was like, I'm gonna be a YouTuber. And I was thinking to myself, everybody else is YouTubing, I should get on YouTube and tell my story. Everyone has a story to tell. So it started off with me just doing things like meal prepping. I had started really getting into gardening and really loving that process so much so that i said this is pretty cool a friend and i were hanging out and he said why don't you do like a tv show i was like a tv show that's kind of major that's big but thankfully here in houston we have a station a network that allows us to get access to great equipment training and education for houston media source I was like, okay, well, let's go for it. We both were already previously associated with the channel. So I said, I started it, I stopped it. Let's pick back up and start what you said you were going to do. So that's where I am today. Her wellness journey is my journey, but not just my journey. I've now included other people's journey in wellness. And when I say wellness, I don't mean, oh, let's lose 20 pounds. That may be part of your journey, especially because health is important, but it's mind, body, and soul as well. So with that, I wanted to make sure that I included that for other people because my, I know so many amazing women and I've met so many amazing women who have journeys, whether it be mothers, whether it be their businesses or their life and what they're set out to do or what they're doing or what they've dealt with. And in the hopes of the, us sharing our stories, we can inspire other women and bring a community of women together where we can help each other foster positive uh, imagery of women and so much so even fostering a community where we can encourage and uplift each other who's telling my story who's telling the stories of the amazing women I know I'm meeting and I'm seeing why not share those stories tell that story so that generations later we can all sit back and look and say man you know my mother my grandmother was a phenomenal woman and inspiring women if women like Maya Angelou or Beyonce didn't take that risk and put themselves out there and share their gifts their talents and their stories we wouldn't have those women to reference. And those are definitely inspirations of mine. Looking at people who inspire me, of course, like I said, Beyonce, Maya Angelou, uh, Michelle Obama. Gosh, I mean, there's so many great women, but not just those women, but it's the women in my family. You know, my great grandmother, a grandmother, a, mo a mother. It's the women I meet, you know, today. I met a lady who was just so kind and doing a proficient job at doing her job here where we set up. Or it's the women, a woman at the grocery store that gives you that random compliment like, oh, I love your hair, or you have great skin, or whatever. It's those women. Those women, their stories. That story could be a story that reaches someone and truly does inspire them. So that's where her wellness journey came from. It's, it's sharing those stories. It's giving people a platform to uplift others. And then in the process, hopefully they'll grow and develop. I know with me being on the other side of the camera, I've definitely been inspired. I've been uplifted and encouraged to see and know there's so many good people because sometimes we don't get to see that. Sometimes we don't get to see in the news or in the media when you turn on the TV, people doing great things. But don't be fooled, there are amazing people, as I can speak and say amazing women out there really doing great things, starting businesses, raising kids, balancing it all, helping themselves and helping others. And Houston is the perfect petri dish or culture where that's happening. And I know LA and New York and you know Hollywood, those are all great places, but right here at home, there are great people. Um, I like to believe, you know, hey, grow where you're planted. If you're here in Houston or if you're in a little bitty town somewhere that nobody's ever heard of, grow there. Use what you have in your environment to encourage others, to push yourself and expand. Um, so here in Houston, I just really wanted to make sure that I took the time to do that, to build a platform here, focusing on the people right here around me. My long-term goal, of course, is to not only have her wellness journey or HWJ TV, 
but also have the opportunity to give other women a platform to come together and let's share their stories on a bigger scope. So this is just the beginning. Stay tuned for so much more. We're going to do amazing things starting this year, 2019, because I feel this is something that needs to be done. There's a purpose behind it. There's a passion behind it. And I feel that so many people will definitely benefit. The women that I'm meeting, the people that I'm working with, they are also passionate and talented and gifted. So I hope that that transpires and it touches you be sure to like comment and subscribe on youtube stay in tune on our website because we will be posting information about how you can watch on houston media source it will stream online as well as it will be on tv if you're in houston area if not don't worry you can always go to hms.org backslash live and you can also stream on those times but i'll be sure to keep that updated on the website as well as keep you posted on Instagram and YouTube as well. I do appreciate everyone's kind words and support. The community has really gathered around this so I know that we are doing great things and the more things are going to be coming. So thank you for everyone for your support and love and I hope that we can continue to reach other people. Like I said, if you have a sister, a friend, a mom, a cousin, a coworker that you feel would benefit from this content or maybe someone you're interested in being a part of the movement, getting on board and uh, joining our purpose to spread positivity, be sure to, hey, reach out to us. Email is herwellnessjourney at gmail.com. Website is herwellnessjourney.com. Instagram at herwellness. Reach out. Let us know how you want to be a part. Definitely want to build a community where we can grow each other, create positivity, and then have a sisterhood because that is very important. You can't do this alone. Life is hard. These days are hard. This morning for me was hard, but I'm thankful to have people and loved ones and a community to back me and support me in what I'm